Curtis. We are at the End Malaria Now event. Tonight you'll see some of your favorite stars helping make a difference in the lives of others. Hey Car TV, we're here with Patrick and he's the host of this event. <laughs> Will you tell us about this event? Uh, this, this event is uh, to help uh, raise funds and bring awareness about malaria. I heard that one in five children die of it, so just $10 makes a huge difference, right? Well, $10 can make a huge difference because uh, what $10 affords is a net, uh, one of those bed nets, and also uh, some instruction on how to use it, so $10 per net. St show us one of your favorite dance moves. Oh, they can be silly. Okay, it would be the twist. Like, like this, the peppermint twist. What you do, Hi, this is Patrick Warburton, and you're watching Car TV. Hey, Car TV, we're here with Tamara Malek. Hi. Hey. Okay, so before you go on your performance, because you did a performance the other week, do you get nervous before you go on stage? I do sometimes, but I have my dancers and my best friends around me to support me and make me feel comfortable. Is there any rituals you do before you go on? Well, we say prayers, and we just mess around and have energy drinks, of course. <laughs> How'd you get started in acting? How'd you get on Shake It Up? Uh, well, the starting in acting is now a very long story, so I'll just keep it brief. I was doing PowerPoint presentations while I was in third grade, so my dad threw me in a theater camp to you know, help me with my diaphragm and projecting and being in front of peers and not having any pressure from it. So I learned how to dance from our choreographer, Rosero, So. Props to you, Rosero. You turned a white boy into a non-white boy. <laughs> That's the best way to put it. How did you get started in acting? Uh, I actually got started, uh, I was on a Broadway play called The Lion King, and uh, I did that for a little bit, and then I started doing a lot more Broadway in New York, and uh, now I'm actually on a show called Victorious. It's on Nickelodeon, and I've just been really blessed. Cool. Is there anything you do to help you get ready or anything like a ritual that you do? Well, yeah, I gotta listen to some really good music, something that gets me just, you know, hyped and ready for the show. Uh, hey, what's up, y'all? This is Leon Thomas from the Nickelodeon show Victorious, and right now I'm here with Car TV. Be cool. I am here to support uh, Ending Malaria, which actually I lived in Africa for a year, and um, I did not firsthand witness any cases, but I did go visit people. And um, I did, you know, I tried to help with that cause, and it was something I definitely was involved in, and I saw personally. That's really cool. You got to help them there, and now you're helping them when you're still in California. Exactly. It's definitely something close to my heart. Hey, Car TV. We're here with Sean, who is an acting coach and a voice coach. Okay. So, for all your students you have, do you have any tips when they're nervous before they go in? Um, relax, breathe. Everyone wants to see you do well. So that's it. Just give your gift. That's, yeah, that's good, because sometimes when you go in, you get really nervous and to have Boy. advice from people it helps Absolutely. a lot. Well, you know, if you just think of your talents as being a gift, you're just giving your gift, that's the most special thing you can do. No pressure. Okay, so we have a whole bunch of dance viewers watching. Okay. <laughs> Will you dance for us? Show us your favorite dance move. Let's see, what's my favorite dance move? Okay, I'm a, I'm a 90s guy, so I guess you'll have to be a running man. You are the running man? All right, here we go, so here we go. Can't touch this. Can't touch this. Hey Car TV, we're here with Richard and Dupano and they are wearing some lovely shirts right now. Do you guys see those? And Malaria Now? And Malaria. Well yeah, it's actually it's an event that I founded a couple years ago. Um, you know, after being in Africa shooting my last film called The First Grader, noticed that there was a big epidemic in Kenya which was malaria and I realized how serious of an epidemic it was and the best thing that we could do is like donate nets to save lives of the children in Africa. One out, of, one out of every five kids in Africa will never see their fifth birthday because of malaria and we need and, and the sad thing about it is that it could be prevented and that's what we're fighting to do is to prevent that from happening. Hey guys I hope you enjoyed tonight's event. Let's all of us watching CAR TV take this chance to make a difference in ending malaria. Everybody should visit endmalarianow.org and help make a difference. I'm Madison Curtis with CAR TV. Thanks for hanging with me. Bye. <laughs>